Hey everybody, this is Gregory from Dappy Diversity. So welcome back to this multi-part tutorial series where I'm showing you how to build a full stack blockchain application step by step, all right? So in this final video, I'm gonna show you how to deploy your project, all right? So before we get into that, be sure to subscribe to this channel and click the like button down below. And as always, if you wanna learn how to become a highly paid blockchain developer, you need to join my free training on my website over at dappyuniversity.com forward slash bootcamp. All right, now in this video, what we want to do is take the smart contracts and actually put them on a real blockchain, right? Up until now, we've been, you know, running everything on Ganache, just this test blockchain. But we want to put it out in the real world to see how it works. Okay, so um, you can see a list of blockchain networks here inside MetaMask, right? So the Ethereum mainnet is, you know, where real Ether wor is worth, you know, real money. Um, but these other networks are just test networks. They allow you to, like, play around with your application on a test network, so you're not, like, risking real funds or anything like that. So we're going to use the Kovan test network, okay? So I'm going to click over to Kovan and, uh, you know, I'm going to use, uh, you know, my accounts in Ganache here, which currently have no Ether. Um, and we see nothing inside our application, right? Because the smart contract isn't actually deployed to the Kovan test network. So that's what we want to do, is actually get it out there. Uh, we're going to need a couple different things in order to do that. Okay, so here's, you know, Kovan on Etherscan. You go to kovan.etherscan.io to explore this and learn more about Kovan test network. But we need a couple things. First, we need to be able to uh, connect to the Kovan test network. And we're going to use Infura for that. So Infura is going to give us access to an Ethereum node, right? So an Ethereum node is how we connect to the actual blockchain. Um, and Infura gives you, an Ethereum node as a service, and you can get started for free by just going and creating an account and logging in. And what you do, you'll see your dashboard, you'll see an option to create uh, a project. And what you do, you'll see some details like this, all right? So uh, after you've created the project, you're gonna need uh, this endpoint right here. This is basically the URL for the Ethereum node. So I'm going to go down to Kovan and see this, you know, kovan.infura.io forward slash v3. I'm just gonna copy this, okay? And you keep this uh, for later use, okay? So this is our Ethereum node that we're going to use to deploy the smart contracts and use our dApp uh, on the Kovan test network, okay? So keep that handy. The next thing we need is some actual uh, ether, because if you go here, you know, we don't have any ether to deploy our smart contract with, it's, you know, it's zero. So let's go to Ganache and uh, copy this private key first of all, and we'll just uh, copy it like this. And let's uh, add it to MetaMask. Going to import it like this. Uh, sorry, import account and paste in the private key. Again, don't don't use this account for real on the main net. Um, so now what we want to do is actually request some ether for that. Okay, so we can go to the Kovan test network faucet. So a faucet is basically just uh, a website or a smart contract essentially that uh, dispenses ether. So I can uh, just paste in my address. So I'll paste in the address right here. Copy it. Paste it in here, and he will, uh, this person, Scott Bigelow, inside this chat room will actually send me some. It's a bot, but he's the administrator, and he will uh, let me know as soon as I has, have some Ether in that account. All right, so it just said it was successful. So let's go over here, and uh, let's refresh this. This is the transaction on the Kovan test network that he told me about. All right, boom, there we go. So he sent, said three Ether was sent. Let's see if we can see our balance in MetaMask. Go back here, and there we go. Awesome, we have three Ether in our wallet. And let's rename this. Um, this is the account, let's do it like this. We'll call this the deployer. So details, edit, deployer. So just so we know what this account's for. This account's used to deploy the smart contracts, okay? All right, so we got three Ether. Um, and we can deploy the smart contract with this particular account. All right, so now I'm gonna show you how to deploy this smart contract really easily. All right, so head on over to remix.ethereum.org, all right? So this is a Solidity IDE in your browser, so it allows you to you know edit smart contracts and things like that, but also compile them, run them, deploy them all from your browser, right? It's nice and easy. So what you're gonna do is go to um, your project, find the marketplace, smart contract that we created uh, copy it all right then go back to remix and uh, create a new file so you go to this plus icon here and then we'll call this marketplace capital M marketplace 
Soul. All right, we'll paste the code inside of here. All right. So let's check the Solidity version. Um, so we want version 0.5.0, and you can also go to the ABI to see what was compiled with uh, in development. So if you go to uh, marketplace.json, look for compiler, all right, and this will show you the version. So it's compiled with this, uh, version 0.5.0, this commit hash. So let's go here, 0.5.0. All right, this is it right here, 55A. Yeah, 55A, all right, so close enough. All right, so let's uh, to compile, all good. Now let's run it, okay? So we're gonna check uh, Injected Web 3, and what we're gonna do is select uh, the Covon test network that we got our test ether from, okay? So head there, Covon. It's gonna reload the page, that's fine. Okay. So they're going to have a new version of Remix. That's what this is saying. <laughs> All right, so we're on the Kovan test network. We can still see our smart contract. Let's uh, deploy it. Click Deploy. You're going to have to sign this with MetaMask. All right, so what I'm going to do is change these values. I'm going to edit these to make this happen pretty fast. We'll do 30 seconds. Let's actually just do advanced. So I'm going to do uh, 50 GUE to make this really fast. And the gas limit, I'm going to say... Uh, Let's do a million units of gas. One, zero, 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 zero. All right, so the new potential total will be 0 0.05 ETH, which is fine, for, especially for a test network. Save this, confirm, and it's pending. So I'm gonna wait for this to finish. We can check out the transaction on Etherscan. This is covon.etherscan.io. This will show us uh, if this worked on the test network, and it worked. Okay, cool. So now let's uh, copy this value. So let's uh, see here. This is the contract address. We'll save that here for just one second. And let's go back to our code. Now, you can deploy this smart contract with Truffle, uh, but I just showed you how to do it with Remix. So let's create a new network right here. Normally, Truffle will do this for you. But I'm going to do it manually since we deployed with Remix. Um, I've been having some trouble with Truffle lately getting contracts on the test network. Uh, so let's just do what works for now. So I'm going to change this to network uh, 42. That's the network ID for the Kovan test network. Okay, so just trust me on that. If you want to look up the different network IDs uh, for the different Ethereum networks, um, you can certainly do that, but that's what Kovan is. So let's uh, copy in the address. Go find this information here, contract created. Uh, let's see here. Let's copy this. Uh, let's see, all right. Address, and then let's do the transaction hash. We'll just copy this. And click that. Okay, cool. Now we can verify that this exists in the Kovan test network by saying truffle networks. And it should show us the address on the Kovan test network as well as Ganache. Okay, so here, uh, here we go. Network ID marketplace for this. Okay, awesome. And network ID 42 is, is Kovan, all right. So let's uh, save that and go back to Remix and, or sorry, the app, and let's change the Kovan test network, and we should be able to interact with the, uh, yeah, we should be able to interact with the smart contract now. So let's refresh the page. Now, let's see, it doesn't yell at us. It doesn't say that the contract was not deployed to the network. You know, if we went to mainnet, it'll tell us that. All right, so let's reload it. Uh, I'll close that Remix so we get the, stop getting those errors. But see, here, it says Marketplace has not, uh, been deployed to the network when we switched to mainnet, but we don't get that error whenever we, uh, you know, go to Kovan, so that's a good start. Let's try to add a product. Let's just say Apple AirPods. And let's, um, let's do a price. We'll just say one Ether. Okay, add product. We'll get the MetaMask confirmation to pop up. Let's confirm the transaction. Let's edit the gas just to make it fast. Edit, we'll do fast, 30 seconds, okay. Confirm, and let's wait and see if it finishes. All right, it worked. I just got the transaction confirmation on Etherscan uh, from MetaMask. So I refreshed the page in order to see their product. You might have to do that as well. Um, but there you go. So your smart contract is deployed to a real blockchain. So it's not running on Ganache anymore. It's actually running on a public blockchain network. Now, granted, this is a 
test network, right? Uh, so the, the Ether on here isn't worth real money, but, but still you see that your smart contract actually works on a public blockchain, and that's really important. All right, guys, so congratulations. You have come to the end of this tutorial series where I showed you how to build a full stack DAP uh, from scratch, right? So congratulations. You know, you guys have stuck it out, done the hard work, and you're on your way to becoming a real world blockchain developer. All right. So again, if you want to find all the code to this, check the link out down in the description below. You can find a full length article on my website with a link down below as well. So you can get the written instructions if you need more clarification about anything. And, you know, as always, be sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and click the like button down below. And if you want to learn how to become a highly paid blockchain developer, you need to join my free training on my website over at dappuniversity.com forward slash bootcamp. All right. Until next time, guys, thanks for watching Dapp University.